Popular Logan Square Farmers Market canceled for this weekend, leaving vendors scrambling as their produce is prime ready for sale. WGN's Joel Hillary tells us what's behind this weekend's cancellation. Hi, good evening. I stopped by the Logan Square Chamber of Commerce and spoke to the executive director briefly earlier today, and she told us that she's been in meetings all day about the farmers market being canceled on Sunday. An alderman that we talked to says the cancellation is due to traffic safety concerns for vendors and customers. On a typical summer Sunday, Logan Square residents and friends Brandon Crowell and Tom White say you can find them at the neighborhood farmers market stretching along Logan Boulevard from Milwaukee Avenue to Whipple Street. It's a really fun experience to be at the farmers market. It's like a big family thing and everyone comes here to get like fresh produce. The Logan Square Farmers Market is scheduled to operate through October 29th, but is on pause for this upcoming Sunday. Ward 1 Alderman Daniel Espada, who represents Logan Square residents, says the farmers market crowd and vendors have grown exponentially, and the upcoming market is on hold as leaders work on a traffic safety plan to keep vendors and customers safe. When we have that much car traffic, that close to thousands of guests, 100 plus vendors, there's a lack of safety there. We need to ensure safety as much as we do success. And so we're trying to figure out a road closure situation. While they are disappointed the market won't be around this weekend, Brandon and Tom say they understand safety comes first. There's a lot of crowd space or like crowding during the farmer's market that ends up happening. So I guess it can be hazardous. I definitely have noticed it's grown like probably a third since last year. Alderman Laspada remains optimistic the market won't be gone long. I love what they do. I love the products that they offer. I think that we can make this come together. Alderman Laspada says he's been working with a number of city departments, including CDOT and CPD, to work on a traffic safety plan. Also, we anticipate hearing back from the executive director of the Logan Square Chamber of Commerce to give us more insight on the future of the farmer's market. Reporting in Logan Square, I'm Jewel Hillary, WGN News.